So this kid here, by the way, this award here was battled between like four or five guys on this team. This was by far the hardest award. This senior class, like I said before, it's, I, every year there's usually one or two in the hat, maybe. But this year here, I, mean, I could I could have given this to just about every senior here. This, I, I say well, this senior group is unbelievable, but we had to go with one. This kid stuck out. Coach, what can I do? You need a ride home? You need this? I'll take care of you. I got it. Coach, don't worry about it. I got this. Hey, could you go do this? Coach, don't worry about it. I got this. Works his butt off. I remember last year, he finally got a 39 and a 300. And he goes, Coach, I didn't even think I could do that. <laughs> and then this year here, he comes out and puts up the second fastest 300 time ever that I've ever seen run since I've been here for five years. The kid just works. And he just helps out everybody. He's got a lot, but his heart must be, like, I mean, like the Grinch, you know how it got outside the box? <laughs> this is way outside the box. What's, what's great about this kid is, um, I guess I said before, I did my internship, so I was at that first week of September. And the first time I saw him, he said, okay, coach, i got to get ready for indoor. It's September, like, we just started in school, and he's like, we got to get ready. So I said, all right, you know, give me a day, I'll put you know, a workout for you. It's him and Leo at the track. Him and Leo at the track. He's like, Coach, I gotta get ready, I gotta get ready, we gotta win this, we gotta win this, we gotta win this. Right? And like Coach said, you know, he'll ask, you know, do you need help with this, do you need help with that? I remember we went to a meet at RPI, and then they had the concession stand, I was very picky on the one I eat. Right? So I'm there, and then he has a muffin in his hand, and then I'm like, Coach, is a muffin. He's like, four bucks. I'm like, gosh, that's a lot for a muffin. So he's like, Coach, you want me to get it, you want me to get it? I was like, no, I don't need your money. <laughs> <laughs> so we go to Cornell, and then we're in a rest area, and then we're waiting in line. He's like, Coach, you want to get this? You want to get this? I'm like, no, dude. <laughs> like, I got this. Like, even, even a few days before sectionals the state qualifying, he's like, you know, Coach, I got to beat this guy. Whatever I got to do, let me come in early. Let's do go. Wait, we, wait me some more. Let's run a little harder. I was like, go. We have a plan in place. I'm not going to burn you into the ground to go and do something. He's like, Coach, well, you know, I need to do this. We need to do this for the team. we got to win this. we got to win this, Coach. I'm saying, all right, just trust the plan, and you'll be all right. He's like, Coach, you know, whatever we got to do, whatever we got to do. That's how, that's how his personality is about everything. But uh, I noticed you said a few things about Booker and Leo. I know the choice is going on, right? Yeah. Where's Leo in the film? Hey guys, so where, where, are the, where are the quarters at? Are we about to just the <laughs> still? He's playing track. He's doing track. Right. Hey, no pressure. It's just a joke. Make it happen. Get up here.